Hello kids, today we are going to learn addition by carrying over. A special way to add by carrying over. Okay, so this is the standard 2 book mathematics. Here 8 sticks and 4 make 12 sticks. Okay, so let us tie 10 of them in a bundle to make 110. Okay, so here tens and units. Here total 12 sticks. That means 12 units. But we should separate tens. That means a bundle of 10. Okay. So, tens and units, we divide tens and units. So, how many tens make a bundle of 10? So, here, 10 sticks, we have to make a bundle. Okay, so how many remains? 2. Okay, so 10, 1 tens, okay, and 10 units. Same as adding 7 and 8 units make 15 units. Okay, adding 7 and 8 units make 15 units. Let us make a bundle of 10. Okay, so here, tens and units. A bundle of 10. We have made a bundle of 10. Okay. Here are one, tens. Okay. One tens. So how many remains? You mean units. Okay. So five units are remain. Okay. So one tens and five units. We cannot put a number bigger than nine in the units place. Okay. That is why we make a bundle of 10 and move it into the tens place. Units are single items. Okay. Understood. Use sticks or beads or dots to carry out the following conditions and write the answers. Okay. See, tens and units, okay? Here, nine units plus six units, okay? So, nine units and six units, okay? So, we have to add nine plus six. How many nine plus one? Nine in the mind plus six, okay? So, we have to put to make a dot. You can draw a stick, you can draw beads, okay? you can draw dots, okay? Like that. See, here are, okay? So, nine plus six is equal to Okay, C, 9 plus 6, sorry, 9 plus 6 is equal to total 15 units. Okay, but we have to make a bundle of 10. So, here we made one bundle of 10s and units, 5 units. Okay, same as 6 plus 5 is equal to 11. Okay, so 1 tens and 1 units. Okay, tens and units, 7 plus 4 is equal to 11. So here 1 tens and 1 units. Same as 6 plus 2, 6 plus 6 is equal to 12. Okay, so 1 here and 2 here. So 1 tens, a bundle of 1 ten and units 2. Okay, 2 units. Tens and units 4 plus 9 or 9 plus 4. Both are same. Okay, so 9 plus 4 is equal to 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, how many? 13. Okay. So, here are 13. So, 1 tens and 3 units. Okay. See, here are 10 plus 14. Okay. So, 10 that means 10 dots. That means 1 tens. A bundle of 10. 1. Here are 14. That means in 14. How many bundle of 10? 1 bundle of 10 and 4 units. Okay. So, see. We have to add. So, 2 bundle of 10. That means 20. And units 4. So, 24. Answer is 24. Okay. The same addition can be written like this, tens and units. That means 10, 1 tens, 0 units, 1 tens, 4 units. That means 10 plus 14 is equal to 24. Okay. Same. Carry out the following additions. 20, that means 2 tens, 0 units, 1 tens and 6 units. Okay. So, we have to add 0 plus 6 is equal to 6. And 2 tens plus 1 tens, that means 2 plus 1. 3. Okay. So, answer is 3 tens and 6 units. Same as here. Tens and units. 1 tens and 7 units. 3 tens and 0 units. Okay. So, here 7 plus how many units are there total? We have to add the units first. Okay. So, 7 plus 0. 7 and we have to add now tens. How many tens? 3 tens and 1 tens. That means 4 tens. Okay. So, 4 tens and 7 units. That means answer is 47. Tens and 1s. 3 tens, uh, sorry, 3 units plus 0 and 3 plus 0, 3. 1 tens and 4 tens, okay, so 1 plus 4, 5 or 4 plus 1, 5. Same as tens and units, 5 plus 0, 5 units, 1 plus 5 is equal to 6 tens, okay, 1 tens and 5 tens is equal to 6 tens, okay, we have to, by carrying over, okay, we have to separate that bundle of tens, and remains we have to put in a units okay so tens and units in one to nine okay zero to nine we can't put a number bigger than nine in the units place okay 
more than nine we can't put in a units place okay so that's why we make a bundle of ten and move it into a tens place okay units are only single items okay units are only single items see let us first add the units and write in the units place see here tens and units place okay here one tens five units okay and nine units see one ten five units that means 15 plus nine that is nine that means only a single number that's why units so here five units plus nine units see first we have to add units place okay from the units place so five units that means five dot plus nine units okay so five plus nine okay we have to add total 14 units okay 14 units but units can't more than nine numbers okay unit can't more than nine number okay so of 14 unit of this units let's make a string of 10 and write the remaining four units in the units place okay so see here 14 units okay answer is 14 units so we have to make a beads of 10 okay so 1 10 and 4 units 10, 10 plus 1 is equal to 14 okay so here 5 plus 9 is equal to 14 but we don't have to write the tens place here because this is the units place so we have to write only units place number 4 and the tens place of 1 is carry over here okay so this is tens place that's why tens is carry over here so 1 tens so 1 also addition or is also adding by remaining tens okay so 1 plus 1 2 tens okay so here is 2 tens okay so 24 is the answer this is not okay here this is not stay here okay so we make a new 10 with the 10 units and carry it over to the tens place now 1 tens plus 1 tens how many tens is equal to 2 tens okay thus we have 2 tens in the sum we write those in the tens place okay now next tens and units okay so here two tens and three units that means 23 okay and 23 plus 17 we have to add so two tens and three ones and one tens and seven seven ones sorry seven units okay ones or units both are same okay we can write ones we can write units okay so first we have to add units place okay so three units see here three units plus seven units is equal to 10 units okay but here in units place we can't write 10 okay here we write till number nine okay you we know we cannot put a number bigger than a nine in the units place that's why we make a bundle of ten and move it into the tens place okay so see three units plus seven units is equal to ten units so ten units that means one tens okay and zero units we made a we make a bundle of ten okay so all tens goes to tens place so unit in units place zero units okay the one tens in this carried over and written in the tens place we write zero in the units place because nothing in units place okay see 23 plus 17 three units plus 17 units is equal to 10 units but one is on tens place so we should carry over one here on tens place okay and we add one plus two is equal to three 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. So, here are 4 tens and 0 units. Answer is 4 tens and 0 units. That means our answer is 40. Okay. The sum 4 tens plus 0 unit means 40. Okay. Hope you understand. See, 23 plus 17 is equal to 40. 40 that means 4 tens and 0 units. Okay. Next, tens and units. Here are also same. 1 tenths and 4 units that means 14 plus 29. 2 tenths and 9 units. Okay. So first we have add. We are going to add the units place. 4 units plus 9 units is equal to 13 units. But at units place we can't write more than 9 number. Bigger than 9 number. Okay. So here are 13 number. So what we do? 13 unit that means 1 tenths and 3 units. Okay. 1 tenth that means 10. 10 plus 3 is equal to 13. So, we make a bundle of 10 separate and put in a tens place. Okay. See, 1 tens and 3 units. That means 13. Okay. See, 4 plus 9 is equal to 13. So, here are 13 units but we can't put here 13. 1 is on tens place. We should carry here. Okay. On tens place. Here we write 1. Okay. See, 2 
plus 1, 3. Here 1 plus 1 plus 2. Okay. 1 plus 1, 2. 2 plus 2, 4. 4 tens. Okay. So see, 2 plus 1 plus 1 tens makes 4 tens. Okay. Here are 4 tens. See, 4 tens and 3 units are is equal to 43. That means 14 plus 29 is equal to 43. See, here 4 plus 9, 13. 1 plus 2 is equal to 3. Okay. So, here are, see, tens and units, we have to write like this because here we can't write 13 on units place. We should carry over 1 tens into tens position. Okay, in tens place. So, we, we have to write only units. That means 3 units and 1 tens. Okay, so we should carry over here. Number 1. Okay, 1 tens. So, 1 plus 1, 2 tens. 1 tens, 2 tens, plus 2 tens. That means 4 tens. So, the answer is 4 tens and 3 ones. Okay. Remember, when adding numbers, first add numbers in the units place. Okay. When adding numbers, first add numbers in the units place. Okay. See, here are some examples. Look at the pictures and make a problem of addition and solve it. Okay. See, tens and units. How many tens? See here, how many tens? Okay. One tens. How many units? One and two. Two units. Okay. Here, how many tens? One and two. Two tens. How many units? One, two, three, four, five, six. Here, six. Okay. So, what is the answer? Okay. See, here we write. Now, 1 and 2. How many tens? 1 and 2 tens. Okay. So, we have to write 2 tens here. How many units? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 units. Okay. How many tens? Bundle of tens? 1, 2, 3. Okay. 1, 2, 3. So, 3 tens. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay. 3 plus 2, 5 plus 2, 7. 7 units. So, we have to add 2 plus 6, 8 units. 1 tens plus 2 tens, 3 tens. Okay. That means 38. Okay. Here, 25 plus 37, that means 5 plus 7. How many? Count it. 5 plus 7 is equal to 12. Okay, 12. But here 1, we should carry over in the tens place. Okay, here. And only we write 2 here. Okay, so 7 plus 5 is equal to 12. Okay, 1 we should carry your 1 tens in the tens position. So, 1 tens plus 2 tens that means 3 tens plus 3 tens that means 6 tens. So, answer is 62. Okay, same as here tens and units. Okay, so 6 plus 5, 3 tens and 6 units, 2 tens and 5 units. Okay, so we have to add and do it like that as I shown you. Okay. Remember, we can't put a number bigger than a 9 in the units place. So, that's why you make a bundle of 10 and move it into 10's place. Okay. When adding numbers, first add the number in the units place. Okay. Understood? So, these are the sums of adding addition by carrying over. Okay. Okay. So, we will see you in the next video. Till then, goodbye. Take care. Bye-bye.